Catholic Daily Mass Readings November 11th, 2023 Memorial of St. Martin of Tours, Bishop A reading from the letter of St. Paul to the Romans Brothers and sisters, greet Prisca and Aquila, my co-workers in Christ Jesus, who risk their necks for my life, to whom not only I am grateful, but also all the churches of the Gentiles. Greet also the church at their house. Greet my beloved Apinitus, who was the first fruits in Asia for Christ. Greet Mary, who has worked hard for you. Greet Andronicus and Nunia, my relatives and my fellow prisoners. They are prominent among apostles, and they were in Christ before me. Greet Ampliatus, my beloved in the Lord. Greet Urbanus, our co-worker in Christ, and my beloved Stasis. Greet one another with a holy kiss. All the churches of Christ greet you. I, Tertius, the writer of this letter, greet you in the Lord. Gaius, who is host to me and to the whole church, greets you. Erastus, the city treasurer, and our brother Quartus greets you. Now to him who can strengthen you according to my gospel and the proclamation of Jesus Christ, according to the revelation of the mystery kept secret for long ages but now manifested through prophetic writings and according to the command of the eternal God, made known to all nations to bring about the obedience of faith to the only wise God. Through Jesus Christ, be glory forever and ever. Amen. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Responsorial Psalm, let our response be, I will praise your name forever, Lord. Every day will I bless you, and I will praise your name forever and ever. Great is the Lord and highly to be praised. His greatness is unsearchable. I will praise your name forever, Lord. Generation after generation praises your works and proclaims your might. They speak of the splendor of your glorious majesty and tell of your wondrous works. I will praise your name forever, Lord. Let all your works give you thanks, O Lord, and let your faithful ones bless you. Let them discourse of the glory of your kingdom and speak of your minds. I will praise your name forever, Lord. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke. Jesus said to his disciples, I tell you, make friends for yourselves with this honest twelve, so that when it fails, you will be welcomed into eternal dwellings. The person who is trustworthy in very small matters is also trustworthy in great ones, and the person who is dishonest in every small in very small matters is also dishonest in great ones. If, therefore, you are not trustworthy with this honest wealth, who will trust you with true wealth? If you are not trustworthy with what belongs to another, who will give you what is yours? No servant can serve two masters. He will either hate one and love the other, or be devoted to one and despise the other. You cannot serve God and mammon. The Pharisees, who loved money, heard all these things and sneered at him. And he said to them, You justify yourselves in the sights of others, but God knows your hearts, for what is of human esteem is an abomination in the sights of God.
the gospel of the Lord. Praise to Lord Jesus Christ.